Hi friends, welcome to Azure Content. This is part 7 in common errors in ADF playlist. In this video, we are going to learn how to mitigate this error. Self-referencing of variable is not allowed in ADF. So let's see everything in details. So whenever we try to make use of set variable activity in Azure Data Factory pipeline, then we should make sure that the variable is not self-referencing itself. Else, it will throw an error called the expression contains self-referencing variable. A variable cannot reference itself in the expression. So uh, let's see when we get this error. So let me go to ADF pipeline and let me directly create the pipeline. Okay. So suppose in this pipeline, which is pipeline 48, let me create a variable called var1. Okay. And now if I drag set variable activity here and suppose I assign a value to this variable saying Azure. Okay. And I want this value to be coming as the output of this set variable activity. So then what I will try is I will try to assign value to this variable, which is variable one, which we have just created here. And then in this value, if we go to this variable and if we try to self reference it in order to get the value, which we have assigned here, as the output of this activity, then it will not let us to do that. It will throw the error saying the expression contains self-referencing variable. A variable cannot reference itself in the expression. So what we do in such case is we try to get help of another variable in the pipeline. So let me do one thing. Let me create another variable called var2. Okay. This variable 2 and what we will do is instead of var1, we will try to use var2 and that will assign the value present inside var1. And now whatever value we have defined here, that should be coming as the output of set variable activity. So now you can see the error is gone. Okay. And now we can, and now we can try to debug the pipeline. Let me zoom out in the pipeline. Okay, so now let me hit on debug and we will see if we are getting Azure as the output of set variable or not. So it is succeeded and you can see var2 holds the value as Azure, which is actually the value which we have hard coded for var1. But here in this set variable, we are assigning var1 value to var2. That's the reason in the output we are seeing var2 having the value as Azure. Okay. So earlier what we were doing is called self-referencing of a variable. And in order to mitigate that, we have just created one more variable and we have assigned the value of the first variable into the second variable. So now just to give one more example, what I will do is let me create another pipeline and we will try to create a counter that will have an incremental value for each iteration in the pipeline. And we will try to see if we can achieve that using one variable or not. Okay, so this is pipeline 49, which I have just created. And what I will do is I will create a variable called counter. And what we want is in this counter variable for each iteration, it should have different values. So for, for the first iteration, it should have zero as the value. For next iteration, it should have one and it should go till five. So for using this looping thing, Either we can use for each or we can use until. So I'm going to use until and what I'm going to have in this expression is until the counter variable is equals to five till that point, you should loop. That's what I'm going to give command to this ADF pipeline. So there's a function called equals and here I'm going to set the condition as variable counter is equals to five. So till the variable counter reaches value equals to five till that point, keep on looping the iteration. Okay. So now the expression is fine. Now inside until we are going to use set variable activity and we are going to add one to each of the counter value. So right now we have assigned a default value as zero to the counter variable. And now you can see in this counter variable itself, I want to add one in each of the iteration. So for that, I'm going to use add function. And here in this counter variable, I want to add one. Okay. 
So now you can see the expression contains self-referencing variable. A variable cannot reference itself in the expression. This is the same error which we got earlier. And the same reason uh, is that we are using counter variable. And in this counter variable, we are trying to assign a value where it is referencing the same variable again. So that's the reason it is giving this error. So what I will do is again, we have to take help of another variable. So let me try to create a new variable called temp variable. And now again, we will make use of this temp variable in order to assign value to the counter. So here, instead of counter, I will select temp variable. And now temp variable is going to have an increment value of counter. And then again, we are going to drag another set variable activity. And this time, what we will do is we will use counter and we will just assign the value of the temp variable inside the counter variable. Okay. So these two set variable activities name, I will just change. So this is temp variable and the other one is, let me give us counter variable. Okay. So now what is happening is, this temp variable will have an increment value of 1 to this counter which we have initialized at the pipeline level with 0. Okay. And then for the first iteration, it will have 1 as the value because it will add 1 to 0. And then the same will be assigned to this counter variable. Okay. Now temp is also 1 and counter is also 1. Now for the second iteration again, temp will be equal to counter plus 1 which means 1 plus 1 equals to 2 and the same will be set into the counter variable okay and this will go on until uh, the counter reaches 5 okay now we are just getting one error which is in does not match the field value which is basically because this va variable is of string type and we are trying to uh, add 1 here so basically it expects the uh, variables to be of integer data type. So let me change this string into integer. So this will solve the issue. Now we should be good. We are good to run the pipeline. Let's hit on debug and we will see if our counter is getting the expected result or not. So let's see. Okay. So you can see the pipeline is in progress already. Uh, four iterations are completed. Let's wait. Yeah. So you can see uh, let me okay so you can see this is first iteration then this is second iteration this is third iteration this is fourth iteration and this is fifth iteration so in total five iterations have been completed because the reason is in until we have given this expression whenever counter reaches five you can break through the loop okay so here if we see the output of first iteration the temp variable value is 1 because by default we had set the temp uh, variable value as 0 and upon increment by 1 it is giving the value as 1 and the same should be assigned to counter variable. You can see 1 is assigned to counter and for the next iteration that is second iteration temp value became 2 because now the counter value is 1 and it has incremented by 1 so temp value became 2 and then in the second iteration counter value will also become 2 okay now similar case when uh, in the third iteration temp value became 3 and the counter value also became 3 fourth iteration we are good temp value is 4 and counter value is also 4 in fifth iteration temp value is 5 and counter value is also 5 and this is the last iteration because uh, as i told until ha is having this expression when counter becomes 5 just exit through the loop okay so we have achieved this target uh, using another variable which is temporary variable so you cannot self reference a variable in adf this is a limitation of set variable activity so that's the reason we get this error and we have successfully uh, mitigated it using a temporary variable okay so in a set variable activity you cannot self reference a variable you cannot reference the variable being set in the value field that is no self referencing is allowed okay and we have already seen the workaround in the demo so to work around this limitation set a temporary variable and then create a second set variable activity the second set variable activity sets the value of the iterator to temporary variable okay 
So you can uh, mitigate this error using another variable and using one more set variable activity. So don't get confused whenever you see this kind of error. It's just because set variable activity does not let you uh, self-referencing the same variable. So you can create one more variable and then you can assign the value which you want to assign in the first variable and the same will be reflected in the second variable as well and that variable you can use further in the pipeline. So that's it for this video guys. I hope you liked the video and I hope you got some help from this video. Please hit on like button and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. Thank you.